This free step-by-step -step video comes to you directly from Haynes. You can complete more than 200 jobs on this vehicle when you purchase the complete Haynes online manual at haynes.com. Coolant renewal. Open the driver's door and pull the bonnet release lever. Lift the bonnet slightly. Slide the safety catch to one side, then fully raise the bonnet. Unclip the support strut and engage it with the bonnet slam panel. Unscrew and remove the coolant expansion tank filler cap. Chock the rear wheels. Position the workshop jack adjacent to the sill jacking point. Then raise the vehicle until the wheels are clear of the ground. Support the vehicle with an axle stand under the jacking point and remove the jack. The engine undershield is secured by a mixture of bolts, screws and plastic expansion rivets. Undo the screws and bolts, then prise out the centre pins slightly and remove the expansion rivets. With the fasteners released, Remove the undershield. Place a suitable container beneath the left-hand side of the radiator, as viewed from the driver's seat. Rotate the drain tap anti-clockwise a couple of turns and allow the coolant to drain into the container. Release the clamp and disconnect the bottom hose. When draining is complete, gently tighten the drain tap and reconnect the bottom hose. Remove the container from beneath the vehicle. Maneuver the undershield into position, then refit and secure the fasteners. Raise the vehicle. Remove the axle stands and lower it to the floor. Remove the jack. Don't forget to remove the rear wheel chocks. Release the clamp and disconnect the heater hose at the engine compartment bulkhead. Make sure the hose is kept higher than the outlet on the bulkhead. Unscrew the air bleed screw from the upper left hand side of the radiator and the one on the coolant housing on the left hand end of the cylinder head. Slowly fill the system with coolant until the level reaches the max level on the side of the expansion tank. Position containers under the radiator and under the disconnected heater matrix hose. Very slowly refill the cooling system through the expansion tank until coolant runs from the radiator air bleed screw and the coolant housing bleed screw. Then refit and tighten the tap or cap. Continue to fill the system through the expansion tank until the coolant, free from air bubbles, emerges from the heater hose. Refit the heater hose back to the bulkhead heater connection once the coolant escaping is free from air bubbles. Release the support strut and clip it back into place. Firmly close the bonnet.